we'll start with the installation of our cloud era so basically to perform uh, or to install your Hadoop on your system either you can install it on a Linux platform or you can install it on a Windows platform so to use your Hadoop on a Windows platform we need a virtual box in which we will uh, use a setup of cloud era cloud era is an ecosystem which gives us a Hadoop environment where we all can perform our Assignments such as map based operations, or you can perform high query operations, edge based operations, or a map based operation in Python. So, different uh, kind of uh, assignments you can perform, uh, which is like provided by cloud data. So, as uh, our subject is DSD layer, so in that subject, the first foremost thing is uh, we need to install a cloud data on a system to perform different Hadoop uh, related. So these are the set of instructions uh, which we have to use to install our cloud data on our system. So the first step uh, before we use the cloud data, we have to install a virtual box. Because on direct, uh, direct on Windows, we cannot uh, install your cloud data. So we have to first of all install a virtual box on our system. So we have to download a virtual box. Then we, then we will uh, download a cloud data setup. And uh, then we will uh, install this setup in our virtual box. And ready to use the cloud data in our system. So from there you can get this uh, virtual box, box setup. So this uh, link, uh, this help file I'm providing in the description box so you can download it from there. So just click on this and download the virtual machine setup. After downloading this, uh, you just uh, double click on the setup and your setup will be ready. So after downloading, you will get a setup like this. So this is the new box uh, where uh, setup will be ready after installing the virtual machine and installing that in your system. Now once your virtual machine is ready, the next step is to uh, install your cloud era. So the cloud era can be downloaded from the following link. You just click on this, you will get a, you will be redirected to download a cloud era. After downloading this, uh, you will get a zip folder in your system. So just unzip that and after unzipping, uh, you will get a uh, unzip uh, setup over there. So the next step is we have to import this setup in our virtual machine and then your uh, virtual machine is ready to, uh, cloud error is ready to use. So the next step is to un uh, unzip the cloud error and then start the virtual box. So once your setups are downloaded, that is virtual box and cloud error, next step is to install the virtual box and after that next step is to import the cloud error setup in your virtual machine. So we we'll see that how to do that. So after uh, your virtual machine is ready, just start this machine. So after starting the machine, you can see here menu file. So inside this, you have to import the appliance. So just click on this, select this browse option, and wherever your setup is downloaded, you just go to the setup and import that setup. So if you can see here, uh, in PDF, I will show you the steps. After clicking the import, then here after clicking that, wherever your setup is downloaded, you just go to that setup, select that setup and open it. After opening, you just have to click the next button until you are not getting the finish. So here uh, there are some certain settings are there like how many CPUs, if your system is a pure code. So in that case, the number of processes you can select, how much RAM you want. So to run a cloud error, the minimum requirement is 8 GB RAM is required. So accordingly, you can select the RAM configuration as well. So you can change uh, network configuration or RAM configuration or your processor configuration uh, after changing over here. And then you can click on input, click on next and your setup is ready. So once your setup is ready, you can see something like this. Your cloud error is imported. After your cloud error is imported, you just click on this green button. After clicking on this green button, your cloud error will start. So this will take time uh, as per the what RAM is there in your system. So as I said, minimum 8 GB RAM is required uh, to start with your cloud era. So once your cloud era is started, you will get a setup something like this. You can see in the back end. Uh, this is the desktop of your system. So we'll wait for a minute and your cloud era will start. So something like this, the setup will be there. So this is our desktop. So now your cloud era is ready to use. So here you can start with your different assignment where I can perform our operation. Uh, 
I can perform in terms of, I can do it on my own height. I can perform in different heights to a pretty low ratio. I can perform in different intervals to a low ratio. So this is uh, what the cloud data setup is. So much cloud data. 